Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. I am Starko Gaming, and we are back with another Dragon Champion video, guys. If you are level 15 or below, make sure to use the promo code Starko to get a free starter pack. To do so, it is very simple. You go in the settings, use promo code, and you enter the code Starko S T A R K O. You press OK, and you will receive ten dollars worth worth of free stuff which include 500 dragons and 250,000 gold giving you a huge boost early on in the game to kick in some awesome progression so today guys we got a lot to talk about before we actually jump into the battleground i should actually put that in full screen too uh <laughs> we got a lot of time because uh yesterday or earlier today depending on what time time zone you are when offenses the offense phase started they, there was a bug a huge bug that the people were allowed to reuse the same team over and over it didn't matter if they kill a team with it or if their team died they could just reuse their team and pretty much everybody was able to clear um, everybody that exported that bug was able to clear uh, all the opening team uh, on the other side obviously and uh, the way that was addressed uh, by the dev was uh, totally wrong and we're going to be honest about that so first let's go take a look at what it was said after this bug was the uh, was found out and was fixed like 12 hours later or something like that uh, that was actually ridiculous how slow it took uh, to actually get it fixed and also the fact that people actually sheet their way into uh, clearing the whole map uh, actually don't get penalized once again people exporting bugs not getting penalized uh, it seems to be a thing with the dragon champion we definitely gotta bash them on that because this is not fair for fair players and if you're wondering guys uh, if I exported it no I did not you can see I did not. My opponent exported it because uh, the pop-up here message. I had like 50 pop-up. I had a very hard time beating my, me per, uh, with this with the, all his best characters all, all the time. So that's pretty fun to watch. But uh, yes, I did not export it. I refuse to export bugs uh, because uh, I feel like I'm not being fair to other people. So let's jump on the Discord server and let's read first what the Lizard Brett said when uh, the fix happened. So, uh, hi guys, I apologize for all the inconvenience caused by this uh, bug. We will uh, make sure that an issue like this uh, never happen in the future, never happen again in the future. Uh, I'm really sorry, yet we cannot reset this season people i received points for the previous round already and cannot roll back or reset the phase for several reason one of those is that some walk might not some folk might not notice that um uh, that it was reset and missed the face entirely and it will hurt even more people i really hope for your understanding and no i do not understand because uh, there's a lot more option to do with cutting first first uh first my option will have been to um to basically reset the current attack phase extended by one day extend the season by one day and boom every day everything is fixed people have to redo their offense uh, you pop a pop-up message on the login screen everybody is aware that they have to redo your off redo their offense and that is fixed nobody end up exploiting the bugs or oh. Or the other solution will have been like Makola here actually said. Um, tension Lizard Bread, a perfectly good suggestion was to award every player full amount of points for this round. I am a software developer. I know this can be done. I'm not saying it is trivial, but effort invested will show your commitment to fair and sport like culture in the game. As it is, the it only shows that exploiting the bugs of pay and definitely a major part of the community feels like that and don't get me wrong my issue is not with the bug but bugs happen it will continue to happen my issue is in the way you as developer are handling the bu bugs explanation uh, exploitation as uh, differently it's not the first time it happened in raid it happened in the whole battleground system it happened when uh, the re rework on tournament came out and never never people got penalized uh, for exploiting bugs which is actually part of the tos term of services says anybody caught exploiting bugs can uh, can add their account terminated or other sentences served to them so uh 
it just showed that if you exploit bugs, you actually benefit from it and people actually play fair, uh, actually are suffering from it. So I wanted to make that clear out there. I want to make my voice out there on that because this is bullshit uh, and talking directly to the dev here this is bullshit this is not how to handle that kind of situation like this just giving everybody max points for this round will actually be a very amazing idea but anyway we still have to do our battleground offense because they are probably not gonna do anything and we're just gonna end up screwed so i gotta jump in there and try to uh, clear eight zones so i can actually end up with a win and i can lose one uh first time victory only so that is going to be a very very stressful battleground for me hopefully i can still pull a victory but that is going to be pretty damn rough to be honest so first we have this one here so no brass actually it's pretty nice we have this panda team not actually bad to beat uh here we have this demon team which actually seems pretty weak and we have this pretty weak work team here so we have a few options to actually go for here uh so the first one here we could the either go with the human or we could go with the um how you call them <laughs> <laughs> the orc but i think i'm gonna go with the human here usually the human actually handled this up pretty easy so let's switch this team to my human team and yes the game's been very very laggy since they actually applied the odds fix for the battleground bug by the way guys it is not just you or me uh, i seen a lot of people complain about it and this is actually a thing right now so let's see if we can actually uh, get a good run by the way guys things that is not a bug that you can actually do in battleground is that if you're about to lose with your team you can back out and try again over and over with the same team the only thing happened is that you lose the 25 points for first time victory so here the first thing i want to do is remove this down that is literally going to be the first thing we need to do so we can actually go kill a renara as fast as possible so first we're going to try to slow this guy apparently we're getting dodge oh yeah i forget we can dodge a lot against uh, those teams uh, it's so annoying so first thing we're going to do is uh, remove the talent we're going to apply uh, debuff immunity and we're going to start to smashing here as fast as possible we're going to kill something that's very easy to kill so we can actually get res and we can actually finish it as soon as possible but this is actually a pretty terrible fight so far uh pretty bad we've been getting dodge a lot holy shit we just keep getting dodge man i hate when that happen but some tmr here so that's not bad now the rest happened so we can actually just kill something but now the taunt is back so it is definitely not going as good as we want it to go uh, so now we can actually get a deal with that now we applied the slow now we don't need to apply the slow obviously so this is definitely not very good but the aoe is actually not doing that bad and now the talent uh, the shell is actually removed but we are in big disadvantage here usually this team goes much better than that to be honest okay so now i guess we're just gonna take this guy out uh, hopefully my my tank can survive oh my god that's gonna be so close maybe he will survive actually but I'm not fully confident about that. It's getting close. No, just before I can actually heal him. So yes, we had a very shitty RNG so far in this fight. So uh, there's good chance we're actually not gonna win here. There's good chance, but we, oh, damn. I think we're gonna win, guys. <laughs> that was actually perfect here. And let's finish this up and boom. We, oh, come on, bro. You're supposed to be dead. Here we go. Here we go, there we go. So we got our first victory event. We had terrible RNG to get started. Uh, we lose a few points, maybe uh, three or four points here because uh, we lost a character. So one less character surviving a rose and one less at full HP. We could get it at full HP at the end. So we lost two points here, but still pretty solid clear here. 45 points considering the terrible RNG we had. Uh, next one we're gonna go for is I'm not gonna go for this one yet because I am actually not sure what I'm gonna use here, to be honest. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use my Panda team, which can actually be pretty rough here, or if I'm gonna use something a little bit stronger. Next, uh, I wanna try here is, uh, I think I could actually try, sh sh throw my, uh, my Pride team here, to be honest. There's not much damage, it's pretty much just Ur. 
and, if, and there's a very squishy tank that has a very very low speed and i do believe my pride team because the pride team does not attack a lot so the pride team can actually uh, do great work on this one you could go with the elf team too to apply the days on them so they don't gain a uh, tmr or we could go with the goblin team but the goblin team apply tmr non-stop so it is not a good option in a personal opinion we could go with the, the or team but i definitely don't want to use that so uh, we're gonna go with the pride team we're gonna try that out i think that boras can actually take care of that that's what we used the last battleground we actually succeeded pretty good so uh let's try to actually make that happen once again uh i i like my chances hopefully rng is gonna be uh better than the previous fight we just did so that'll be very very great if that happened i'm trying to say my best thing for the back uh because we never know what we're gonna be fighting in the back to be honest so we're gonna uh, we're gonna be careful here the first thing i want to try to kill here guys is actually uh puncher face because puncher face will apply down to everybody that can mess up uh every single thing out oh, damn we just got hit by this goddamn uh ability block on him uh that sucks that's gonna sucks and we did not get a great hit so we're gonna kill this one kiri very fast here shouldn't actually be long here uh, this carry is pretty squishy okay bro well the talent is removed but now we got that but we actually can't counter that right now just by doing so so it's actually not so bad and now we can actually damn bro you're mean you're mean let's do this <laughs> i love that i can just do this really really fast i guess we just just finish carry because the talent is just coming back non-stop so annoying so we got the heals here let's finish carry here we go and then we can finish the rest boom you're dead and now uh, we're gonna take care of the best dps here this one and then after that it's gonna be over obviously here we go uh we're gonna taunt again so we don't lose anybody and we lost somebody i didn't think that aoe will be that mean but uh whatever uh, if we can actually survive so we can rest, that will actually be optimal here, obviously. Uh, so here we do that, we're gonna pop the shell so we don't really take damage anymore. We're gonna heal, we're gonna use the least the damage we can do right now so we can actually get the rest going and then boom, this is done. So we're gonna have five surviving euros and maybe we're gonna be able to push it to actually have a uh, full HP on all of them. I don't think so. I think we're gonna be killing it first, uh, to be honest yeah this is dead so almost but still four full hp arrows so we only lose one point so actually not that bad very great thing uh, to actually counter demons by the way guys if you add your pride team build in a decent way so 46 points for this fight this is really really decent let's take a look at what we get next next so we get oh this one so this one there's uh, it's not that strong to be honest it is a decent team but it's just not that strong uh if we can actually uh take a look here we're gonna have uh to deal with trumgar right uh yeah trumgar um is talent is level up okay but his skills okay boring and boring too so he gets the 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 stun and his tenacity is let's check his tenacity his tenacity is only 67 percent so it's actually actually not that bad let's take a look at the teams we got so we're gonna fight the team that's around 106 thousand so we're gonna do a little bit better than that um technically this thing could maybe get it done but that'll actually be quite risky uh, we could go with the orti but i'm saving this team i'm saving the this team too so i guess we could go with this team this thing got three good character oh we could go with this one this one could actually maybe work if it doesn't work we only lose one uh one um one first clear victory uh, but i do believe this this team can actually make it happen because even if we're debuff uh, the towns can still happen on atom and also that does not keep us from actually doing a follow-up attack which is pretty much the point of this team so let's see what we're going to be able to do here there is a more doom though so uh that might actually change things a little bit but first thing we want to do is to actually uh go with this one try to kill this one as fast as possible 
Okay, we get some follow-up tech here. Not as uh, good as I wanted them, to be honest. But let's see what we're gonna get here. Oh my god, so close to not get the bear, man. So close. Okay, can we get the tout? Yes, we got the tout. And now this guy has a, a counter-attack, so we don't really want to attack him as much as possible. So we're just gonna try to ignore him for now. And this guy can take a beating while we are doing so. We got one kill so far, so that's actually not that bad. Definitely not that bad. Now we're gonna do that, we apply the day, so there is no more counter-attack. Now we can just focus on this guy and kill him as fast as possible. So this is going very great. And the town just keep popping, so we are doing, we have a very good RNG, so that is kind of the key point here. Now next we have to kill this guy, because this guy is going to be the mini next when he uses third skill. But actually, we just got that out. So pretty much we're safe for the rest of the fight here, guys. So let's just finish this. Pretty, pretty easy, pretty simple. And that's going to be a great win. We still have the two most important characters in this team, which is General Murdoch and Dr. Frank. So I'm not actually worried. Let's try to see if we can get a stun on this one. No, but we're going to be able to kill her before she even go. Oh, we got more stun out of the way here. So that is actually perfect. Get this guy feeling cool. We're going to have full shield, full HP on everybody to finish this fight. So we're gonna get extra point of until we lose one person in this fight. So this team actually get the job done once again every time I pull this team out, I always get the job done. So you can see we're gonna be getting four full HP, four full shield, and four surviving heroes, which is actually uh a lot of points. <laughs> it is a lot of points, two points away from the maximum of 52 points so we have 49 points on this fight so let's see what we get in the back here in the back we have the goblin team that might actually be the most annoying teams we have out there uh this team what we're gonna have to try to use against that is the goblin team not the goblin team but the demon team and that's gonna be our chance if we want to beat that so we're gonna save the demon team for that now this team is actually not very dangerous seems actually pretty easy we can actually throw our last team against that our weakest team here i do believe it has the power to actually make that happen uh this team here we do have the EOE, we have the heals and we have the tank so i do believe that this is going to be strong enough to take care of that so let's throw that out there and let's test this out if we get this that means we beat their weakest team weakest team with our weakest team pretty much guarantee us a win here at this point so let's do this let's see how this is gonna go that's gonna be very interesting so what we want to kill first uh is actually this guy because this is the mini so we want to kill him as fast as possible because of his stun, his buff immunity, and all the tralala. So uh, we want to take care of him as fast as possible. Then uh, this guy is big AoE. And the third skill can actually damage us quite a good amount. So we're going to take care of that. And now all we're going to do is the rest. Let's kill the healer first so we get no heals. And ability block on everybody. There we go. And uh, that take care of that heal here. We're going to try to keep our HP as high as possible. No stun here. That sucks. But we got town. So that is great. And then we got the disability. Which is always nice. So yeah. And that's actually going to be a pretty damn easy fight. I was expecting uh, more a challenge than that, to be honest. A lot, than, <laughs> a lot more than that. Uh, and oh, one character is gonna not going to be full HP. So still, I have two full shield, I believe so. So with no one full shield. So it's actually a pretty solid round. 48 points is definitely pretty solid. So five surviving heroes, five full HP and one shield. So that was actually a pretty good run here okay so that give us this one this one i still gotta wait to see uh how, what we're gonna get in the back here before i go for that now the panda team um well let's go take a look at what we actually fought so far let's see if there's anything else we haven't seen so far so we the oh we haven't seen the human team we need to keep the orc team for the human team that is definitive uh, we get the pandas so the human team is coming the rest seems pretty weak yeah we already fought most of those good character a lot of characters in the ten thousand. this is why his power is higher than me but it's a roaster is weaker than mine okay so now we can actually use a good team if we want here 
or we can use an average team so let's take a look at what we got we got the elf team we got the panda team i think we're gonna keep panda team for the second weakest team they have so uh, i do think i want to actually yeah we're gonna throw this this elf team here i think this elf team is gonna handle that uh just very very easy in my opinion uh, let's take a double look yeah this is the panda team the elf team is gonna murder that the elf team is gonna murder that and it's actually a you know i only got three good characters on there but they they aren't there to actually do all the damage which is why this team can actually get the job done actually they do an amazing job against a panda team to be honest so uh that's gonna be go uh pretty well actually go pretty well we're gonna have the demon team left to face the goblin team and then the or team to face the human team and then the other team i got left i forgot the panda team to face whatever else they have so i think that's actually going to be great so first thing we're going to do is we're going to apply the daze on amber so she does not annoy us i'm going to try to damage her as as much as we can early on in the five we're going to drop a critical chance up so we can actually murder shit and uh well oh, that did not crit as much as i wanted but we got the town tier uh we got the stealth we get the ability block and that should pretty much uh take care of everything here ember is dead the tank is about to die so yeah this team is definitely get the job done now hopefully i can actually keep her alive that is the most challenging thing because she is very squishy she is very very squishy now this guy is annoying me though okay nope getting dodged that's the thing though the dodge can actually be very annoying that's the only thing you're actually really gonna worry about in this uh fight to be honest so let's try to kill this dps here oh there we go take care of most of it and this guy is pretty much done so very good fight no healer to actually sucks but still pull a very solid victory here ember uh basically she never attacked so that was actually perfect and here we finish with five surviving heroes three full hp and the one full shield so we still have a very good amount of points let's see what's the points where's the points at right now i think we're doing pretty solid so oh yeah we're doing pretty solid already so we only have 385 points to catch up and we're doing much better and then he was doing so oh that's actually interesting the way that we did that I did should have put Creel with the human team because that makes no sense, Creel here. But uh, that's gonna make my life easier here, actually. No tank here, we can actually just ability block Creel and win here. Uh, yeah, this is gonna be the Panda team. Let's try this out. This is maybe the only team I'm not actually fully confident we're gonna get it done, to be honest. That's gonna be a rough one with the talent lead, but we, sh in theory, we should be able to pull it up. I actually, we should just ignore uh, Corel here and murder Talon uh, really early, and that should actually guarantee us the win, I think. I do believe so, but we're gonna see here. We get a counter attack. Uh, we got that. Uh, we're gonna drop a shield on there to make sure she's still alive. We're gonna dodge. And now let's see how this is gonna go. We get the taunt. Now we're gonna. Didn't that slow her? So that's not optimal. But that should be fine. Oh, uh, yeah. Everybody gets stealth. So what's the point in that? <laughs> oh boy, now it's too easy. Okay, next, I guess we can actually go for her. So we don't get the reflection pretty much. That's what we're trying to avoid here. Oh, but if we get dodged, that's not going to work. Okay, here we're going to use that again. So we can actually drop some heals. I guess we can go for her. Ah, uh, we got the reflection, but reflected the, um, the, the healer. So that's actually pretty awesome. Personally, I'm going to buff up my tank. And we're going to take care of her as fast as possible. Here we go. Two kills. Counter attack is back. So yeah, we should be able to go for eight clears without losing a single uh, first time victory guess, which is actually, I'm gonna beat this guy that actually abused the bug. So that's actually pretty awesome. That's gonna be awesome. I still score 48 points in the next big die here. 
five full HP, five surviving, and one full shield. That was actually pretty awesome. Okay, next we got this team. This team is going to be the orc team. And then we got this team that we're going to throw uh, whatever else we said. This, if we can kill Dr. Frank really early, uh, that will be awesome. But that's going to be a very tough one, to be honest. But the demon team, the more they get attacked, the more uh, TMR they get. Turn, turn meter to get so we actually uh she'll be able to get that done so first we're gonna jump in there we're gonna drop our orc team here and uh let's see how this is gonna go and yes i do have that this team that's weird huh that is so weird but that works so good <laughs> That is until my hard deck is actually fully ready to take this plot. Uh, this spot uh, so far is uh, HP is just a little bit too low to be part of my mirror team, to be honest. So let's see how this is going to work. Now we have this guy, which is going to be very annoying. But if we can actually uh, get him stunned or something like that early in the fight, that will be awesome. Now I want her to go before my Tron Guard goes. That is literally the most important thing to actually have happen here. Um, actually, it happens. So now we can actually murder this guy. So it does not annoy us too much. And yeah, let's just murder this guy. There we go. Boom. Boom. Well, it's not like that's going to bother me. You're still dead, bro. Uh, well, this one, I'm, are we going to save it? since they have a buff Im debuff immunity for now so we're gonna save that we're gonna remove buff immunity from one of those which is gonna be this one and then we can actually murder this one we're gonna need to put ability block on her too so she does not use her third skill anytime soon that's another thing we want to achieve too we had a lot of slow apply to us so that is actually hurting us no stun uh working here that sucks at least we get some heals. Okay, can my zero go yet? Jeez, there we go. That's all I needed. Let's bring more minions here. Yeah, yeah, bro. Boom. Uh, she needs a heal here. I was trying to avoid that, but I guess we're gonna deal with it. Pop that. Here, we have to kill that, actually. Oh, I forgot I had that goddamn shit here, man. Damn it. We might actually have to restart that, guys. This is not going as good as I wanted. We're going to apply that there so we can actually work here. We have to kill her. If we kill her, we win here. That's pretty much the only thing that's left here. It's this DPS. So we have to be able to snipe her at some point. That's pretty much the objective. And this is not helping. I don't think I handled that uh, like I should have, to be honest. But let's see if we can still pull a W here. Oh, so close. Die, die. Okay, she's dead. Next, we get that. Okay, we should be able to handle that. Yeah, we should be able to finish that. Healing here. Not as good as I wanted. I made a few mistakes here, but we're still going to be uh, pulling a good win here. Ability block here still, so she cannot actually uh, tilt. That is great. I'm gonna bring more minions just in case we get to do more healing. I don't want to go too crazy here yet, just in case we can do more healing. There we go. Try to see if we can get more people to full HP. That's kind of the objective. I don't think so. I think we're gonna be just a little bit short. Yeah. But still, we did a pretty pretty good fight here. That was the, I think that was the most dangerous fight. And uh, that was a very risky fight I did, but we still pull a good victory. Three surviving hero, one full HP, at least one full HP, which is actually pretty great. And we haven't lost a single first time victory, so we're doing pretty damn good here. So if we win this first try, or even second try, or even 10 try, uh, we are pulling an amazing win here against a cheater so that is actually pretty awesome so we're gonna go with slinger lead so because we're gonna get attacked a lot and this team this team should definitely be able to handle the whole package here i don't really see us losing here but we never know rng can be really messy sometimes but if my buff can actually survive long enough to use a third skill and second skill ons we should be able to pull a good victory here and they dodge on my buff, which is actually pretty awesome. So let's start with this guy. Uh, 
we shall use yeah we shall use that on that so we can actually have that stun coming out there we go no shock damage to the star code that's actually a perfect start here at least no shock damage for now still probably gonna get some because we'll get a talent out but hey that's fine Ah, oh, goddamn piggies. I hate the piggies. Okay, that is not bad. Man, he used that skill very early. Usually it does not use it that early. What the hell? That's fine, it's fine. We can still taunt. Yeah, yeah, we get the, the blind, we gotta deal with it. We're just gonna get wrecking this tank here really, really fast. Oh, turn meter up. Then we can actually, yeah, give this guy. Yeah, let's do that, boom. Uh, actually, we should put attack down on this one. Oh, then that put attack down. Ability block, maybe? Okay, we got ability block, so that's not so bad. Uh, I don't really want to use that yet. I want to kill him first. Oh, we're lucky, our, uh, our buff is dodging a lot here. Now we'll bring back the taunt, the stealth, the debuff. That is great. And we're going to pull another victory here. This is done. That got scary uh, for a minute at some points, but we still pull a pretty damn good win here. So, eight first time victory, guys. We just secure a great victory here. The other guy is going to be pissed that he lose Evan that he was cheating that's actually awesome uh, <laughs> that makes me feel so much better uh, so overall we score 1558 points which is uh, one point of win away from my personal best, I believe so, uh, which is going to be, you had 800 points here, 2358 points, which is going to be a great win for Starco. So, uh, well, hopefully this video was awesome for you guys. I actually have a lot of fun making this video also had a lot of fun blasting uh the, the people who cheated with exploring the bugs and also blasting the devs and not taking the, pr the proper measure to counter bug exploitation so uh guys share your opinion with me on everything that been happening with this battleground how do you feel about it also don't forget to drop a like on this video as the, it is the only way youtube knows that this content is awesome and should be shared to more people also subscribe to the channel check out check the bell next to the subscribe button to get notified when we post a new video about dragon champion since we post on a daily basis and also guys if you want to have quick access to our infographics guide or just talk to me directly make sure to join the discord server the link is in the description down below so you guys keep enjoying playing dragon champion and i will see you guys again in the next video thank you